guys and welcome to another Tasha Tuesday. Today is the first day of my six week break, meaning nothing but sleep and relaxation. Yay! So in 2011 when Glee was in its prime, I was obsessed with it. I had all the merch, I had the DVDs, the t-shirts, CDs, you get the idea. I also happened to watch the spin-off shows which was the Glee Project, which was pretty much just an extended audition for the people to get on the actual show. Well, in season one, there was this amazing singer called Damien McGinty, who not only was I in love with because of his looks and his singing voice, but he was also Irish. And in my personal and biased opinion, Irish accents are the best kind of accent, followed closely by British. Anyway, so I would constantly talk about how much I was in love with Damien McGinty, and then a few days later, one of my high school friends bought one of their DVDs that their grandmother owned, which was Celtic Thunder, the show on DVD. And I fell in love with them. Like, I was like, how have I not known of these guys before? Where have they been all my life? Because not only did they all have freaking amazing accents, but they could sing like freaking angels. I'm not even exaggerating there. They sound amazing. So after discovering who Celtic Thunder was, I went out and bought all the DVDs and CDs that were available for me at the time. See, not lying, there is a butt ton here and they get watched and listened to on a regular basis. So I have been lucky enough to see Celtic Thunder twice live in the last three years. The first time I got the tickets for Christmas and what originally happened was my auntie had bought the tickets from a friend and was going to give them to my grandparents for Christmas because she thought she would like, they would like them. So my mum found out. She rang out my aunt and was like, no, you don't understand. Tasha needs these tickets. Like, she is in love with each and every one of these people in Celtic Thunder. She needs it in her life. My auntie goes, are you sure? Like, she's 16. Are you sure this is the type of, like, thing she wants to see? Are you sure she wouldn't rather go to, like, One Direction? And mum was like, no. No, this is, this is what Tasha needs. Tasha's gonna love it. She will appreciate it much more than the grandparents will. So my aunt wasn't fully convinced that this was the tickets that I actually did want, but she sold them to my mum anyway, and I got them for Christmas. So at the first concert I went to, David McGinty wasn't there because he was currently on Glee, but that didn't matter because I got to see everybody else. They were amazing. I bought this Celtic Thunder t-shirt and I also got a program, and it was absolutely incredible. I never really understood people who cried when like their favourite bands or whatever came out. But I understood after that concert because I cried just a little bit when I saw them. The second time I saw them was earlier this year. My mum was ever so lucky enough to win tickets to go see them, which was amazing. And yes, I cried again when I saw them. Again, no shame. And let me tell you this. Damien McGinty, who was there this time, is a lot cuter and sounds a lot better in person than he does on any TV show, DVD or CD that is out there. So when I went the second time, I also got this amazing program, which was for Celtic Thunder Legacy. And they're all a little cute on the bottom there. Emmett, Keith, Damien, Ryan, and Neil, and they all sound freaking amazing, just letting you know. And that's my story for this week, guys. I'm probably a little bit too obsessed with Celtic Thunder and the Irish in general, but that's okay because their singing voices are amazing and their accents are even better. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and if you're new here click that red subscribe button because I post videos every Tuesday. I hope you have a great day and I will see you all next week. Bye! Also, if anyone from Celtic Thunder is watching, hi, I'm Tasha. I'm slightly obsessed with you. Bye!